TV series craze si Rocky Batara. Rocky. Hello po. Hello Julie. Hi. Hello. Hello. First of all, congratulations sa bago mong concert which is Limitless. Thank you. Thank you so much. First question ko, ito tinatanong ng mga viewers ko, bakit daw po Limitless yung title ng iyong concert? Um, limitless because actually hindi ako yung nag- <laughs> hindi ako yung nag-isip ng title actually sila Paolo sila, sila direct Paolo Valenciano sila yung nag-conceptualize sila ganito um, they said na parang they want they, they want to highlight um, yung mga skills I I think I I feel like it's a great opportunity as well it's a it's a great chance then mm-hmm. para makipakita ko din ang aking mga skills at ma- share ko ang aking mga talento so ayun i will be playing different instruments um i will be dancing um and then Basta hindi, hindi ko kasi pwede yung share pa yung mga, <laughs> hindi ko share pwede yung pang i-share yung mga ibang pang mga detalye but We're very, very excited kasi um, katulad nga din ang sinabi ko din kanina, di ba? Parang kapag limitless kasi, parang ano ka, um, you're not you're, you're not afraid or you're, you're not limiting yourself sa mga capabilities mo. Kumbaga, for me, ang definition ng growth is all about exploring your capabilities and expanding them, honing them. Ayun! <laughs> <laughs> Kasama natin sa yeah. mga places. O, oh, di ba sa Limitless magkatrabal ka sa Mindanao, Visayas, and Luzon. Anong mga particular yeah. places dito yung pupuntahan nyo o ipipicture na makikita namin sa concert? Anong mga particular Ayun. places yun? Particular places. Yung nakita nyo sa teaser, yung La Palmera Mountain Ridge, yung Grand Mountains. Yun yung isa sa mga highlights talaga ng trilogy. It was so, so nice there. Tapos, um, kapag kumunta ka dun sa gitna, ayun ko, hindi ko ma-explain yung feeling eh. Parang, parang ano, parang abot mo yung skies. Ganon. Tapos, mm-hmm. bihira din ako mag-hike. So, first time ko din na makapunta or like makaakit ng uh, bundok. Tapos, meron pa kami isang pinuntahan. We went to uh, the Grand Mosque. Ayun, sa Cotabato naman yon. First time ko na yung makapunta doon. Ayun, it was so peaceful there. And then, um, we were greatly accommodated as well. Um, we did different activities. Um, di ko pwede sabihin yung mga activities na yun. Pero, <laughs> nandun siya. Um, ano pa ba? Ngayon, nagpunta kami sa isang parang rock formation. Rock formation siya. Sobrang, sobrang ganda. Sobrang grabe. Hindi ko ma-explain yung feeling. Pero kung nandun ako, parang, alam mo yun, gusto ko lang tumira doon. And then, yeah. Yeah. That's it. That's it. Um, ano pa ba? What else did I miss? Kung may mga na-miss man ako, panoorin nyo na. <laughs> panoorin nyo na lang yung ano, yung Mindanao leg. Kasi for sure, ano eh, For sure, i- ibang ibang klaseng feeling yung mafe-feeling nyo kapag ka nanood kayo nun. Kapag parang ka part din kayo nung, nung trip, part din kayo nung journey. Mm. Yeah. Ito, follow up on that. Ito, question din from the viewers at sa fans din. While doing mm-hmm. daw yung limitless, ano daw yung mga realization mo o mga natutunan mo while doing those trilogy? And ano daw yung babagawin mm-hmm. mo after doing the trilogy? Nako, ang dami. Ang dami talaga. Um, a lot of people kasi are asking me kung ano ba yung Limitless Trilogy. Um, for me, parang hindi, hindi kasi siya na eh. Hindi kasi siya just another online show. It's actually beyond that. And like what I've said, it's very special to me and to everyone behind this project. Nakasama dun sa mismong project. Parang... After nung trip na yun, actually, nung naandun pa lang ako, um, naging, na, naging vulnerable talaga, like, naging medyo emotional ako a bit. Because, na-realize ko na, 
ang dami pang pwedeng gawin sa buhay. Like, there's more to life than this pandemic. And la- la- lahat tayo, gusto nating makawala or like, maka- matago sa itong pandemic. Gusto nating, we all want to see the world and build real connections. So, dun sa Mindanao, parang talagang solid na nakahinga ako. Ganon. May mga bagay din ako na natutunan. Alam mo yun? Kasi kapara makabangon ka, kailangan mo muna mag-heal. Mm-hmm. And para makatulong sa pag-heal mo, kailangan mo huminga. And that's the cycle of life. Mm-hmm. You have to go through the process. So, what makes it really special for me is because I've never been this open and it it has taken this project into a whole new level. It's a very deep and personal level. So, ayun, it made me appreciate life and people even more. And I am beyond happy because I miss traveling and we all do. Yeah, more importantly, reconnecting with people. And it's something we're missing out for quite some time. Yeah. Okay. Next question ko naman. Nabanggit mo kanina, di ba, yung... Uh, guest stars mo dito si Christian and si Jong for Mindanao. Yes. Aside from mm-hmm. the two, meron pa ba kaming mga surprise celebrity guests or even personality na makikita namin? Kung meron man, siguro... Meron, in- meron, definitely. Meron, pero kasi um, nung sinoot namin yung yung brief, yung first mm-hmm. part sa Mindanao, talagang si Jong and si Christian, hopefully sa mga susunod na legs sa Visayas and Luzon, definitely may iba pang mga guests na mag appear dun sa, ano, mm-hmm. dun sa trilogy. Yun. So, sobrang, ano, sobrang excited talaga. Sobrang excited talaga ako. Kasi, um, yeah, it's, it's really about, you know, collaborating with, with people. And I've worked with Christian so many times na, and he's a close friend of mine. And si John, like, sobrang talented niya. He's from Mindanao. Um, and then we'll, we'll be guesting um, artists as well from Isaias and Luzon. So, yun. Excited ako. Sobra. Follow up on that lang. Paano daw po pinili yung mga guests na yun? Sila ba yung nandun um, talaga sa Visayas or... Uh, paano daw? Paano pinili? Pinili? Actually, nga, no. Ang dami namin, <laughs> dami namin mga nakaline up talaga. Ang dami namin mga um, nakalista. So, we have a group na, oh, dito kando kasi kami nagbe-brainstorm eh. Mm-hmm. So, uh, what if ganito ganyan? Oh, um, hopefully, ito yung mga guests natin for this leg. Ganito ganyan, ganito ganyan. So, yeah, from there, doon kami pipili kasi kung sino po yung pwede, sino yung available. Kasi ang hirap din mag, baka like, may iba silang stuff na ginagawa or baka busy sila. And, um, ayun, talaga yung na-iris pa din naman namin. Kaya, yeah, we'll see. <laughs> we'll see kung sino, kung, kung, kung sino ang ano, kung sino ang mapipili. And for my last But, question. Sure, sobrang gusto ko talaga silang i-guess. Kung pwede ko lang silang i-guess lahat, i-guess ko na talaga silang lahat. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And for my second to the last question na lang, yung mga songs mo dito, di ba, nagka-travel tayo sa iba't ibang lugar, will it mm-hmm. be, you will perform ba yung mga ethnical or cultural songs ba? O mga songs mo rin mismo yung marininig namin in tune of uh, ethnic na dun sa place na yun? Um, dun sa Mindanao leg namin, parang wala kaming um, ethnical, I mean, mayroon, merong ano, may merong isang part doon kung saan uh, i-share nila yung kanilang tradition, yung yung culture nila. Um, and then, may mga chants din kasi na, na may, may, may ganung vibe. And then, there's this one song na um, makikipag uh, collaborate ako with, uh, with, with people na like performers din doon sa Sultan Kodarat. Um, mga dancers, instrumentalists. So, yeah, may mga primitive instruments din doon. Medyo kakaiba yung feel. So, yun, isa yun sa mga songs ko na ginawa ng ibang classic arrangement. And then, hopefully, uh, I don't know, like, sige, I will see. We'll see sa, sa Visayas and sa Luzon, baka may mga um, local songs or like local artists na ma-feature din doon. So, ayan. 
Okay. Yung last ko, actually, hindi naman siya question. Appreciation lang to. Comment from Lance din. Ang sabi lang ng isa sa mga live viewers natin is, in love daw po ba si Julie? Bakit ang press niya? And clue naman daw oh! po si <laughs> Well, I am in love with life. I am in love with life. That's all. And, um, if, yeah, a lot of people have been asking if I'm single. Yes. Yes, I am. I am uh, I'm enjoying I'm enjoying my single life. Mm-hmm. And um yeah, actually hindi, hindi naman ako, hindi naman ako naghahanap or anything like that. I'm just I'm just happy the way that I am now. Yeah. Follow up on that lang daw. Uh, pwede daw daw pong mag si David Licao ko sa concert mo since sobrang successful ng Heartful Cup oh. and fans oh. are amoling for David and Julian, so meron bang guesting na magaganap sa Limitless? Uh, Makikita ba namin? Oh, depende. <laughs> depende. Depende. Depende sa mapag-uusapan at depende rin sa kanya. But, uh, um, I, I would like to work with David again. I mean, it would be nice again to, to, to work with David. Um, hopefully someday. Someday again. Ayon. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, we're good friends. We're good friends. We're okay. Looking forward on your next project, Ben, and hopefully sa concert. Thank you. Thank you so much. Okay. Thank you, Julian, and congratulations again. Excited na. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Bata ko kinilig sa last question. Hindi ko alam. Thank you, Rocky. Ayun. Thank you, Rocky. Um, Maraming kinilig. <laughs> next. 